this video, we're going to be doing a fudge competition. Whoever can make better fudge. Let's go. I will start first with my fudge. It's going to be a Reese's fudge. Um, yeah, here, here goes. Okay, so we got our sweet and condensed milk here, chocolate chips, butter, salt, peanut butter, and um, vanilla. So what we're going to do is we're going to add our chocolate chips into this metal bowl. It has to be metal. Then add the butter. And these aren't exact measurements, just rough, you know. Then add the salt. I'll use this spatula. Okay. Mix it all around. Okay. Now you're going to do what's called a double broiler technique. Heat up this pot, a large pot full of water. You're going to put this in here. And that'll heat it up and prevent it from ever, you know, burning the pan or getting any burnt chocolate. And it'll be nice and smoothly melted. So this will be done in a moment. Okay, just finished mixing that all up. Nice and smooth. Okay, next, come over here, grab your sweetened condensed milk. Throw that in there. Okay. Once the chocolate's melted, you'll add the sweetened condensed milk. As you can see, I already did that. Um, I'm gonna stir it around for you and uh, then I'll be back. Okay, you can take it out and mix it around. Probably be a bit easier for sure. Mix it around until it's nice and smooth. Right now it's, as you can see, a bit chunky. Might put it back in the double broiler if everything's not melted, but I think it should be good. Just need to give it a moment. Looking absolutely amazing, as you can see. Throw it back in the double broiler one more time. Just make sure all the chocolate's melted. And yeah. Okay, I'll be honest, I've never done peanut butter flavor before, but we're just gonna randomly add this and hope it's hot enough to swirl, because peanut butter is like, you know, pretty firm. So we're just gonna add this a little bit everywhere. And add some on the top, and then once we add it in, we'll um, mix it around and add some on the, sorry, add some on the top. So yeah, a good amount on the bottom, maybe add some on the sides here. You know, just kind of get it everywhere. That should be enough for the bottom. Save a little bit for the top. Now we're gonna pour this in. This is definitely melted. Um, grab that, Let's mix it all around. Nice and smooth. Okay. Lift that up. Set it on a towel here. Okay. See how this goes. Is that? We can grab a here's our knife. Mix that all in. Let's grab the rest of this peanut butter. Throw that on top. Okay. Almost got it. Doesn't, you don't need to get all of it. Just get as much as you can. Let's see how this goes. Okay. Doesn't look bad. Like that. Spread it all out evenly. There you have it, Reese's fudge. Throw that in the fridge for an hour or so, and boom.
See you then. Let's make some fudge. First, all you're gonna do is grab yourself a bowl. Then you're gonna put in one egg yolk, one tablespoon of sugar, and then you're gonna wanna mix that until it's completely mixed. Then you're gonna get it, and then you're gonna get a separate bowl, and then you're gonna wanna add some oil in that separate bowl. Now, you're gonna add about a half a cup of chocolate chips. Next, you're gonna boil some water, you're gonna wanna boil some water in a, in a pan, and then you're gonna wanna take the chocolate chips and oil, and you're gonna wanna put them in there. This is called the double boiler technique. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna mix that until it's fully creamy. Now what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna add, add the eggs in there from earlier. And so we're all done. Now you're gonna wanna put that back on in the boiling water and you're gonna wanna mix that until it's fully creamy. Next, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to add some sweetened and condensed milk. This is a crucial ingredient, so you're gonna you can't forget this. You're gonna make sure you put it all in there. And now you're gonna stir that until it's completely creamy. It should be really creamy and nice by now. You're gonna put want to put that in a container with some wax paper in it. That's where the that's where the fudge is gonna freeze. And now you're gonna wanna pop that in the fridge for a couple hours until it's fully set. Okay. So in each bowl, I have put the creamy fudge in there and it's basically cream. It's not actually like set, but hopefully I win. And Caleb is gonna show you his fudge. Here's mine. So his is more of like chocolate mousse almost, but mine's some nice solid fudge pieces. It's fudge squares, peanut butter chocolate. Absolutely wonderful. Look at that. Just look at that peanut butter color. All right, so we're gonna get to the judging. We're gonna Anyways. give to each person and they can vote which one's better. And we'll see who has the most points in the end. Let's go. So I have my, I have made some fudge pudding and they're all gonna be trying it and rating it one out of 100. You're not gonna be rating because you're competing. I'm just tasting. He's just tasting it. All right, so mom, you're gonna go first. How do you rate it? One out of 100, brutally honest. Well, you gotta give me a second. I like the texture. It's not, it is nice and creamy and smooth. Mm. Why don't you go to the next person? I'll think of my number. Okay. What do you rate it, Phoebe? One out of a hundred. Mm. Shouldn't it be one out of ten? Mmm, that's good. I'll rate it. To be really honest. Um, seventy or eighty. 70 or 80, so you want to do 75? 75. Okay, yeah. 75. What do you, so you're going to try it, and you're going to rate my fudge pudding. 90. 90? Oh, yeah. That's good. Okay. Okay, you don't have to rate it. You're just trying it. Okay, what do you rate yours out of uh, 1 out of 100? 88. 88. What do you rate yours? What do you rate yeah, it? Yeah, I'm going to give it a 85. 85. All right. Okay, rating. so now we're going to, so they're going to finish it, and we're going to bring out his... Reese's uh, fudge squares. So yeah, let's go. We just remembered we forgot to rate presentation. So like looks, Phoebe, what did you rate Benjamin's presentation and looks? One what? Ah. Uh, like what? The one rest of the fudge. Bowl. One out of one hundred. Yeah, one out of hundred. Eighty. But for the looks and the presentation. No, no, the the presentation. Eighty. Okay. Okay. For that's looks good. and presentation. I would say forty. Forty. Oh, that's one. Yeah, I'd say like 30. 50? Okay. okay. We'll add up both scores just, and then we'll see. Just okay. the looks. So for, here's mine. We'll start with looks and presentation. What do you guys think? Mm, that was... Presentation, delicious. Phoebe, what do you think? You haven't finished your presentation? No, no, no. Just, just how, what do you think of looks? looks? How it looks. It, it, like 180. I mean 90. 90? I would say like 60. That's right. I'd say like 71. I would say 55. Really? Okay. okay. All right. All right. 
Um, okay, oh, everyone take a square and then we'll, we'll all eat it at the same this time. One the best. So just take a square. I'm not writing it, I'm just trying it. Okay. Okay, three, two, one, take a bite. Mm. It's raw! <laughs> Little Gordon Ramsay. Okay. Okay, who wants to, who's ready to write? Mm. That's good, actually. Um, I am. Why did the chicken mm. cross the road? Just answer this real fast. Um, um what are you rating? Mm. Yeah, this is tough. Mm -hmm. Tastes like Reese's. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, gosh. I give it an 80. Okay. Mm. Mm. What do I give yours? Mm -hmm. 88, I think. Mm, yeah. 88. Mm. I would say 75. I would say 95. Whoa. Okay. I we'll add all that up and we'll let you know who won. So we tied in taste. But I won with looks. So combined, I had a total score, score is right there. Uh, of this. And then Benjamin's score is right here. So, so yeah, thank right you guys so much for watching. We're going to be doing... My score. My score here. Ben's score here. We're going to be doing a lot more videos like this. So, yep. um, yeah, here is your oh. crown you win. This summer, we will be doing a catch and cook video. Definitely check that out when that comes out this summer. And yeah. Waiting for it. Yep. Like, subscribe. See ya.